So, so we're here with Dr. Andrea Smith, and she is a maxillofacial prosthodontist in the Y missing area in Pennsylvania. Now, Andrea, what is it that a maxillofacial prosthodontist does? Hi, Alex. So a maxillofacial prosthodontist is a specialist who practices in dentistry. So a prosthodontist has three extra years of training after dental school to do special cases, complicated cases that involve missing and damaged teeth. So um, what a maxillofacial prosthodontist does is they have one additional year of training and they apply those principles not only to teeth, but also to other parts of the face. Um, for example, eyes, noses, and ears. Those are things that we make in addition to teeth. So it is very extensive training, not just you know, your undergraduate, then your dental school, followed by the three years of uh, prosthodontic training, which I do know are extensive and uh, very intense, uh, plus then that one extra year. Uh, so that is quite a volume of information that you have absorbed and, and you do some pretty interesting complicated cases. That said, what are some of the, your favorite things to do um, as far as treatment is concerned? Yeah, so um, one of my favorite things to do in the prosthodontic realm, so that's more like just teeth, um, is called um, New Teeth Today or All on Four, which is where we have someone who is either missing all their teeth or needs to have all of their teeth removed for whatever reason. And we use implants to replace them in a way that stays in and is really functional, almost like having their old teeth back. Um, so that's something that we can do um, really efficiently actually in, uh, in a day implants can go in and I can actually give them teeth. So it's really rewarding because it's um, kind of instant gratification and, and patients really like it. Um, in the maxillofacial department, these things get um, kind of kooky and really fun. Um, it's very artistic because we're kind of sculpting eyes and ears and noses. And one of the coolest cases I ever had was, um, it was unfortunate because it was a cancer patient uh, but they were doing really well and they had a head and neck cancer and they had to have their eye removed and they had to have part of their palate removed. And believe it or not, these two openings actually oh. met. So you could look down through their eye socket into their mouth. Um, so it was interesting because I made them a denture that closed the hole in their mouth and I made them a prosthetic eye mm -hmm that went in there yeah. and they actually met in the middle um, with magnets and kind of held yeah. each other in. So that was a really challenging case, but um, yeah. it turned out great. And that okay. was, that's probably the coolest thing I've ever done. <laughs> and that sounds pretty amazing. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I can certainly, you know, visually in my, on my own with my knowledge of anatomy, kind of see how that could have become a reality. And, and that's, that's really impressive to reconstruct things that way. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I really like the field of maxillofacial prosthodontics because um, I, I wanted to be an artist. And so, you know, teeth, it's like an art project every day. We get to work with our hands, dentistry, prosthodontics, you know, we get to do art with our hands. Uh, but this just took it one step further where we're actually sculpting parts of the face. So that was um, appealing to me and uh, really fun too. <laughs> That's amazing. And so that is really great stuff. And so I really appreciate you joining me on my channel. Thank you so much, Andrea. And keep doing awesome work because um, I've, I've certainly heard of many, many cases that you've done that have truly been impressive. And, um, and I'm sure you get a lot of appreciation from the patients that come to you. Well, thanks. Thanks so much, Alex. I do my best and try to do the best for every patient and try to have fun while we do it, right? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right. Thanks again, Andrea. All right. Thank you. Ha, ha, ha.